So hi guys, welcome back to my... Oh, hold on. <laughs> hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, today's video is basically going to be an ASOS gym clothes haul. So I'm a curvy girl and I find it really hard to find gym clothes that really fit my body nicely. Um, I have got like kind of one... I would say about two gym leggings kind of thing that work for me one pair is from um, sports direct i know that they work like sports direct usa pro leggings are amazing and i've also got these because i do find that i do find that um gym shorts for curvy girls are amazing but i know that some people aren't as confident as me to be wearing gym shorts so i totally get it so i thought i'll check out asos because they've got loads of brands on there and i'll see what some brands are saying in terms of gym leggings and see if they are curvy girl friendly i would also like to add my lipstick is not um gloss red i would never commit such a fashion faux pas it's actually matte but i don't know why this camera is making it look like it's gloss because i, I would do that like they're not me but yeah um without further ado let's get into the video this isn't actually bad like it, when i was putting the leggings on like the way it just stuck to the right place was absolutely perfect but what size did i get right maybe because of the sizing but basically this reebok set is not that bad however i did order the gym tights in 2xl because i didn't know what 2xl was <laughs> so i was just guessing like yeah bitch you big 2xl that will fit and obviously it doesn't fit so i'm having i'm gonna have to take the leggings back probably but first impressions, I do really like these, except from obviously like all of this spillage over here. Um, I do really like these. I can tell. I hope to God. Do you know like when you pull the seams of your trousers, can you, you not see them? It looks like one of the the thread thingies on the tights has come loose and it's made that line so these are definitely going back so yeah the leggings are really nice and lovely they're nice and stretchy <sighs> you can twerk in them <clears throat> yeah they're all right but i just think that these leggings as you can see they're like kind of falling down you just need to get them in your size and they'll be fine but i love the material on it and the bra what size did i get in the bra i got an xl in the bra but i don't know what kind of boobs i thought i had <laughs> shy. your boobs are big like xl wear what i like about the top half is you've got the option of the zip don't know if that really makes a difference but i guess if you're sweating and you need like that extra five centimeters of air you can just undo the zip and you'll be saved but it's quite thin considering it's actually like reebok it's quite thin so i don't actually know no there's not going to be much support here but because of my body shape i find that a lot of leggings are like super nice on my legs and then once it comes up to the waist obviously well, these ones i can feel that they have tried to make this little section over here a bit um a bit more fit in but oh actually they haven't done that bad of a job the whole point of having this little section here is um probably to suck you in a tiny tiny bit and to also um make sure that the leggings stay up but obviously with all the leggings that i get they're either a nice fit in here don't fit here or fit here um too tight here so I am kind of stuck um, but with these ones I'm getting a bit more tightness so I think this is the ASOS 4505 I think it's like a new gym active wear range which is nice but I can tell that these will probably fall down actually no I do like these now, now that I'm looking in the mirror they feel much tighter than they are they have got like an inner lining 
I don't know if there's like extra material in here which makes this bit kind of stick to me a bit better than the other ones. But these ones are working much more. It does feel like I am sucked in in this area here. And the way it's stuck to my legs, they kind of do feel like the, the Nike athletic wear ones. And these were very reasonably priced, which is another reason why I like them. So yeah, I think there's, it's a thumbs up for this one for me. Ironically, guys, I feel like all of my gym legging problems have just got that tiny bit better because these gym leggings have actually got a tight front waist. Well, if that ain't amazing, I really don't know what is. Because not only, oh, and it's got a zip. Got compartments out here. We got compartments, girls. Put a bit of money in there for your KFC after. Oh, and then we've got the 4505 logo. And guys, when I tell you that this function here, for my curvy girls yet, this function here is life changing. Like a lot of people don't know what it is to go to the gym and every time you take one step on that treadmill, your trousers start falling down. So, so the fact that this has the tie front waist is absolutely amazing. So basically these have got like the same kind of specifics as the last ones, except from they've got the tie front waist and they've also got the little pocket. And I just think, I just feel like this is revolutionary. Not gonna lie, I think the color is not me at all. I, I don't like this color, unless it was like a matching set or something. I'm really not a fan of this color. But I did order the same exact ones in black, just in case I felt like this was too much of a reach. And I'm very glad I did. So well done ASOS for this. You just tie it and then the band is like here. It literally feels like someone's put like um, a shoelace inside here. And I just don't know why it took company so long. Like, why have I been struggling for this long? All it took was a damn shoelace. This is lit. I do actually see myself working out in these and they're so soft. Oh my God, they're so soft. And the key to having um, good consistency in the gym ladies is to get nice gym clothes. Because listen, when you'll be putting on your little outfits for the gym and you're feeling all nice, I'm telling you, it'll make you actually want to turn up and actually go because you're like, I did not just spend 30 pound on gym leggings to not be wearing them. So. Got a slight camelage or slight, you know, there's a lot of space around this bit, but it's not actually a fully effective camel. It, at the moment, it looks like a baby camel. So that is also positive news because it means that I don't have to pull my legs all the way like proper high, which normally gives me a camel toe because we've got the tie effect. So these are lip, these are proper lip. So um, what I can say about these is as soon as I put them on, I felt like it was just, it was just, you know, sucking onto all of the good stuff, should we call it. And it was really, really nice. And another thing I do like also is the fact that it's got this kind of um, mesh material at the back. I think it just makes it look a bit more sexier, adds a bit more, some more feels to the leggings makes them look even cuter than they are. So I really love that um, because it's like, it's, you're showing stuff off, but you're not showing stuff off and I love that. Um, and I can feel around the waist with these leggings. I don't know if it's the same 4505 um, um, group or whatever you want to call it, but it does feel like it's much, much, much tighter around the waist. And it doesn't appear to be giving me that much of a camel. So all praise to the most high. Thank you, ASOS. But the only thing I don't like about um, the leggings that I have been trying on is the fact that they're so long. There's some here, like it goes all the way to my ankle. And then there's like, there's some more like, Jesus Christ, is this the tall range or is this the medium height? And the thing is, yeah, I'm not even that tall, so I just don't understand, like, why do I need so much material? I'm five foot five. Like, surely, 
these can't yeah i didn't understand that part but whatever um but as i said at the beginning of the video the best gym clothes to get for curvy people in general in general is um shorts because shorts don't fall down because they're not being pulled down by your thighs or whatever they stay in the place that they're meant to be and i feel like the fit you can't go around wrong with the fit but obviously if you're not as confident um as i am to say it might not be for you but hopefully this video was very helpful for you because i know the struggle of finding um curvy friendly um fitness clothes and hopefully me buying new gym clothes will actually make me go to the gym because i refuse to feel uncomfortable this summer last summer i felt so uncomfortable because i was doing my masters all i was doing is waking up eating sleeping like i could barely fit a shower in there so this summer i'm gonna go to the gym i'm gonna show off my results and i'm just gonna flex on everybody so but yeah thanks guys for watching this video hopefully it was really really helpful for you and hopefully you can take something from it and you can hopefully buy something from it <laughs> um this video is not affiliated or sponsored or anything i spent my own money on um all of the gym clothes so it is my honest opinion and i wouldn't direct you in the wrong direction anyway but don't forget to like comment and subscribe if you've got any recommendations of where you get your um fitness clothes leave them in the comments so that i know where to shop that would also be so helpful for me and yeah don't forget to like this video because it helps um my video and don't forget to subscribe and turn your notification bell on so that you know when i'm about to post again but yeah thanks for watching i'm consistently posting and i'm getting a bit gassed now but yeah let me just cut off this video before i start talking too much um before someone walks into my house and starts talking so um yeah bye guys